What's going on guys? It's Isaac. I am heading over to my buddy Dan's house. He he is the one, if y'all don't remember, or if y'all don't know about, he bought my 1968 Triumph Trophy motorcycle chopper. Here it is, right here. He's been doing a good job with it. And again, guys, this is a uh, 1968 Triumph Trophy motorcycle. Probably ought to get it out into the uh, sunshine. And there's the man of the hour, Dan the man. Hey man, you wanna roll that bike out into the uh, sun? Which one, this one? Triumph, Triumph, your bike. Man, such a beautiful bike. Oh look, you gotta wipe it down and everything. I get bent out of shape. Yeah. It's an interesting uh, paint color you got there, bud. Some some John Deere green so, uh, with uh, some uh, gold flake. It's actually uh, orchard green with gold flake. Yeah. I think orchard it's Plymouth, green. It might be a Plymouth Chrysler. From the 70s? Mm, I don't know. 60s? I just picked it out. You just picked it out. <laughs> he had some slides. And it was so, Plymouth? I think so. Okay. All right. Well, I didn't come here for this uh, Triumph motorcycle. Dan uh, told me about a uh, mini bike mm -hmm. that he's gonna sell me. Yeah. 100 bucks. Got a, got a good deal on a couple mini bikes from a uh, guy who does warranty work on them. Three of them for 400 bucks. You bought three of these and there they are. Yeah. For 400 bucks and you're selling me this one for 100 bucks. Yeah. I like you so much. Thanks, bud. I like you too. You're all right. And it is a Coleman CT 200U. Yep, they're 500 bucks new. 500 bucks new. Yeah. This thing's cool. Uh, the only problem I've seen that Dan told me about is the pull handle. Uh oh. Maybe just need Here. <laughs> Hold They're, the camera. Just needed to be yanked on. Does it have uh, gas in it? Uh, I don't think so. I've got some right there. Yeah, it's got some gas in it. Oh! oh. oh. What? The clutch is bad. hundred bucks, man. Come on. <laughs> I guess I should have messed with that one, too. <laughs> oh, man, I it smells got, like tire rubber for some reason. Yeah. Yeah, I got, I got the other two running, man, but... Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> How about you take that one? <laughs> look, man, I'll take whichever one. That's cool. They're all the same. Okay guys, it's the uh, mini bike invasion. We have five mini bikes here. Dan told me about these mini bikes for sale and uh, well, whoops. We wound up with too many of them. Let me see. 
the total for all of these five mini bikes we have paid 650 bucks for, right? Yep. 650 bucks. Uh, these two over here are Dan's. These three are mine. So they are all uh, two. Uh, four of these total are the CT 200 U's and. A bonus here is the Baja Warrior. Yeah, right? Baja Warrior 200. Uh, the difference, well, there's lots of differences. The frames are different. Everything's different except for the, uh, well, still a clone engine. But uh, what I like is the front shocks and the headlight. John has no idea about the three mini bikes I'm bringing home. He only knows about one. So, surprise, John. All right, let's see where this thing is. I bet you have a hole in the fuel line. So, Dan is gracious enough to help me work on a mini bike today. In the right hand. That's right. Because it'd be nice to have all five mini bikes running. Ow! You hit me right on the shin with that thing, man. Well, I mean, you don't look for any drop very much, do you? That is uh, gasoline in the oil. That is good. Yeah. I don't see any oil at all. All I see is gasoline. Yeah. I, I still don't get why we were getting oil out of it. I'm wondering if there's a hole in the case. And then we have to take off the flywheel. I think there's a hole in the case. Did you get it? You got it. Man. You're alright, man. Come on. There we go. Yep, there's a hole in the case. Got some dead wells. Look at that. Uh, looks like it's time for a predator. I don't know what happened. Well, it looks like a bolt or something came out and got stuck somewhere. So just to show y'all what we're looking at. I knew it was going to be a hole in the case. Right there, we got a hole in the case. Uh, something got stuck in there. Not sure what. A bolt came loose or something and got whacked right in there. These are nice to have, man. Yeah. These are the uh, charging... Stator. The charging coils or whatever. Unfortunately, uh, this is damaged, but maybe it'll still work. We don't have an engine to put on it. Harbor Freight's open. Harbor Freight is open. Yeah. Reckon we ought to go ahead and buy a Predator. You think so? Sure. Yeah. So we're in Winterville, North Carolina. And we're just about to hop out right at the Harbor Freight. It's green, you know. It's not anymore. <laughs> okay. So we're back from Harbor Freight. We have our engine. We have our mini bike. Let's take the engine off of this and put this one on. 
Hey man, maybe we ought to time ourselves. Started? All right, let's get going. this Baja and hooking me up with these awesome bikes. You're welcome. Yeah. So I guess that's it for this video guys. If you like what you see, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. What should we do with these mini bikes? 